Shifting News. Explore. Feel. Shift. Hello everyone. Welcome back to Shifting News. We are here to tell the stories and create super shows of places, cities, things, and personalities that are shaping the way we live. We are on a fact-finding mission to establish and showcase the truth about the Nairobi Expressway and the lower road. We begin our drive from James Gishuru Junction, and you can see that this area is ready for the installation of girders. We are headed to Sokimau, and we'll be able to showcase a number of changes along the road as we pass through main Westlands area, the CBD along Uhuru Highway, Nyayo Stadium, Imara Daima, all the way to Gateway Mall. Be sure to watch this video until the end. Like it, comment, and subscribe if you are a new member to our channel. Shifting news. Explore. Feel. Shift. On Sunday, the 31st of October 2021, the Cabinet Secretary for Transport and Roads, James Masharia, said that the expressway is 75% complete and the old road will be reopened by Christmas. He noted that the old lower road will be renovated and will be in a better state than they found it. The damage on the lower road was due to the heavy equipment used in the construction. The CS also assured the public that there are plans to plant more trees that will exceed the number of those cut to pave way for the construction of the expressway.
Test runs along the expressway will be done in March 2022 and afterward expected to be commissioned in April. Continue watching the video until the end and enjoy the views.
Shifting News. Explore. Feel. Shift.
Shifting News. Explore. Feel. Shift. Thank you for watching this video. Like it, subscribe, and click the notification bell to get notifications once we upload a new video. Drop your comment and we will be glad to hear your views. See you in our next video.